day the fire is gaining ground on us and even though that we're actively working to try to suppress and uh, establish control lines the weather and the steep and rugged terrain is taking its toll and so we'll make progress but then the fire is making progress faster than we can keep pace with it. We still have people under evacuation because of the how severe this uh, situation is and it is a dangerous situation and we want to keep people out of their homes to protect them. We've stayed here this will be our third night two nights at one friend's one night at another and then the first night we're just in our car. It is heartbreaking and it just uh, we just hope that people can come through for them. The community of Carmel I mean these clothes are I have on I just got them today they're giving us everything we need. I'm so lucky I didn't lose my house and I know some people that have and they all they had is what they wore that day. That's all they had on. When I did leave yesterday um, I ended up seeing flames you know coming up my road and probably about three quarters of a mile past the road you know past my house downhill so it's all below me right now and racing uphill so just hope for the best that's about all I can do.